the problem is asking what is the ratio of the solidification time to the sphere to that of the that of a cube okay uh, sphere to cube ratio so then uh, let me take this uh, radius of the sphere as r the one side uh, length of the this uh, side is equal to stick it as a and a the total uh, volume of the sphere is equal r into q the total volume is equal in this situation a into q then we can calculate the total surface area total surface area is equal Four five uh, r square. So then, uh, what is the surface area for this? Uh, this one uh, is equal six a into square. Okay, six a into square. Okay, that these two values are equal. Okay. So then I am going to apply the Chorinus rule for this uh, one. A total solidification time of the sphere is equal cm the same mole constant v sphere divided by a into square. Okay. Then the total solidification time of the cube is equal the cm uh, volume of the cube divided by volume of the cube divided by uh, surface area a into square. Okay. Then I am going to get the ratio. Total solidification time of the sphere divided by total solidification time of the cube is equal uh, yeah. uh, Cm the Vs divided by A into square divided by Cm V cube so yes take is here is divided by a into square finally we can simplify this one so we can a we can cut so we are give, getting the uh, v is here divided by v a cube into square okay then uh, let me substitute the value for this uh, equation. So V is here. R into Q divided by V Q A into Q into square. Further, we need the relationship between the uh, A and the R for further simplification because uh, Surface area is uh, same. So let me obtain the equation for this one. Surface area is same. That means what if the 4 or 5 r into square is equal to 6 a into square. So let me make a into subject. Uh, 4 5 divided by 6 into square root into r is equal to a. Okay, so that A is equal 1.4472 into R. Okay, 1.4472 into R. So, so I'm going to substitute that uh, value in this here. Uh, 4 divided by 3 into 5 instead of uh, R uh, instead of A. Yeah. Uh, r into q so instead of a i am going to put this one this one uh, 1.4472 uh, into r into q into square okay further we can simplify this one Okay. So then uh, here r into cube we can uh, cut these values. So then uh, this is the cube. 
so then uh, finally we are getting the ratio total solidification time of the sphere to uh, total uh, solidification time of the cube is equal Here finally we are getting the answer 1.91 uh, yeah. uh, so I am mean, taking the 1.91 that means uh, the ratio in between the solidification time uh, which having the same surface area for the sphere and the cube is equal 1.98 uh, sorry uh, 1.91 Okay.